In this exercise, you create views of an assembly, add balloons, and a parts list. You then add a new sheet and document parts of the assembly. Make ADA Mechanical Unit 8.IPJ the active project. Open INV Unit 8 Face Valve Pump.IDW. The drawing has two sheets. The first sheet has no drawing views. On the second sheet, views of the parts have already been created. You will review these at the end of the exercise. In the first section of the exercise, you start a new presentation file. On the Create panel, click Base. Click Open an existing file. In the Files of Type drop-down list, select Assembly Files.iam. Double-click INV Unit 8 Face Valve Pump.iam as the view source. Under Orientation, select Top. Under Style, click Hidden Line. Scale should be 1 to 1. Position the view preview in the upper left corner of the sheet. Click the sheet when you have positioned the view. Right click in the drawing sheet. Click OK. In this section of the exercise, you create a sectioned assembly view. In the browser, expand the view listing to display the parts. Your view number may be different. In the browser, select Pump Pin 1. Press and hold Control. Select Pump Spring 1, Pump Nut A1, and Pump Nut B1. Release the control key. Right click any of the highlighted parts in the browser. Click Section Participation None. On the Create panel, click Section. Select the top view of the assembly. Place a view projection line that divides the top view horizontally to create a full section. Right click in the sheet, click Continue. Under View, Scale, Label, click Toggle Label Visibility to turn off the view label. Move the preview below the top view. Click to place the view. Notice that the spring, pin, and two nuts are not sectioned. On the Create panel, click Projected. Select the sectioned assembly view as a base view. Move the preview up and to the right. Click in the sheet. Right click in the sheet. Click Create. Leader lines with balloons identify every part in the assembly. The item number in the balloon corresponds to the item number in the parts list. Pan and zoom to display the sectioned assembly view. On the Annotate tab, Table Panel, click Balloon. Select the edge of the component as the start of the leader as shown. If the BOM Properties dialog box is displayed, click OK. Click a point on the sheet to define the end of the first leader segment. Right click in the sheet. Click Continue to place the balloon. Instead of placing balloons one at a time, you can use the Auto Balloon tool. On the table panel, click the arrow below balloon. Click Auto Balloon. Select the sectioned view. Place a window around the view as shown. Under Placement, click Around. Under Placement, click Select Placement. On the sheet, click to place the balloons. Click OK. If required, move balloons to improve the layout.
On the table panel, click Parts List. Select the sectioned assembly view. Click OK to close the Parts List dialog box. Note, the Parts List outline is displayed on your cursor. Move the Parts List until it joins the title block and border, indicated by the cursor symbol, as shown. Click to place the Parts List. Zoom in to display the Parts List as shown. On the Navigation toolbar, click Zoom All. In the browser, right-click Sheet 2, click Activate. The second sheet is displayed with part drawings of three parts. Review the browser and the drawings. In this exercise, you opened an existing drawing file and then added a base, sectioned, and isometric view. You then added balloons in a parts list.